Oh my. Uh, well, uh. Hey guys, this is Mummy Gana Who here. Welcome to Sega Sonic Brothers. Jesus! Yeah, this was actually an arcade game. Actually, never got released at all, but recently it was found and put on the internet for everyone to play, and yeah, here we are. So, yeah, this is the last puzzle game I got to cover. And see, we've got Sonic, Red Sonic, Super Sonic, and. Yeah, I don't get it. Also, why is it called Sega Sonic Bros? Are you asking for a copyright takedown for Mario? Alright. And again, of course, I'm not playing this. This footage has been directly taken from. K. Uh, Chaotic 2 Jan. Yeah, that'll do. So, thank him for the footage, eh? So, yeah, I never played this game before, and I also had no idea how this game even works, so. Yes, I'm the best person to copy tape for this. So I'm gonna read off Sonic Retro and see what's going on. Online traditional matching puzzle games, Sega Sonic Bros. has players creating lines and loops using the different color Sonics. Creating a line can be done by connecting Sonics to the same color across, diagonal, above and below one another. Pieces drop from the top of the board in grids of four, with the colors randomly mixing after each drop. The the objective is to eliminate as many pieces on the board as once as possible. A bonus is awarded when the entire board is cleared, with much prices scored depending on how big of a combination was executed. At every 10 levels, a player is awarded a Chaos Emerald. Ooh. Once the Chaos Emerald lands on the board, it will eliminate everything above and on the same plane as it. The background music also changes after every 10 levels, going through each stage of Sonic 1, including both backgrounds of the game's special stage. Once the player reaches level 30, a fourth color is introduced, white. The game continues until the board is completely full and there's no more wounds to drop further pieces, or until the player reaches either a maximum score of 9,999,990 points or level 99, in which case the player's clear time will be displayed on the high score table. Players complete for daily high scores and they can also go head to head, racing to either obtain her 300,000 points or survive longer than they could better. If you know what you, you're doing, Sega Sonic Bros can be completed in less than 3 minutes by maxing up the score. The big points come from multiple clean bosses where more than 4 worlds of blocks are in play. This is easier to achieve on the easiest difficulty before the White Sonics come into play. So, it had, had a testing release back in 1992, but again, it never got released until. until someone managed to buy this one game back in 2016 and pushed it on the game one or two years later. So yeah, this is the arcade game and there's also an unofficial Metroid for this game as well so you want to wish to play it. So yeah, um, ooh, a Castle Ward. So I guess it's kind of like Tetris, I guess? You gotta get one line of... You gotta form like... Loops and... Lines... I don't know, I don't think I get the walls of this game here, honestly. I try to explain as best as I could, really. So yeah, I'll... I think I'll stop talking right now and yeah, that was Sega Sonic Force and I think I covered all the puzzle Sonic game that there is until I get to some modern puzzle game I modern Sonic puzzle game I don't know of, I don't know. Bye. I'll see you next time guys, see you later.